Hello everyone, um, hope you're all well. Um, today I've come to the Norwig Quarry um, in Clamberis, North Wales. Um, I'm going to be checking out the Anglesey Barracks, um, doing some telephoto and wide angle down there. Then we're going to head up to the Australia level, which I don't think you can see it on here, but it's way up at the top. Um, there's some cutting sheds up there I want to show you. Um, some drum houses. So um, I'll just make my way down this track and I'll meet you at the barracks. Hi, so I'm at the Anglesey Barracks now. Um, I'm doing your typical wide angle shot of the barracks. Got them coming in either side. I've got crib gock in the background. I've got some nice clouds. So I'm exposing down for the clouds and I'm overexposing by one just to get some detail in the shadows on the barracks. And then I'll blend them together in Lightroom. I'll just show you on the camera what I'm looking at. Okay, so it's a bit of overexposed, so I'm just going to bring the exposure down a touch. Um, I'm going to reduce the f-stop down to 11. Um, just change the brightness a bit. I don't like the sky; um, it's too bright in the in the overall. So I'm going to reduce that by introducing a 0.9 nd grad. Um, so as I add that. You'll just see the sky darken a little bit. And then uh, to finish, I'm just going to crop in um, just to get rid of any distractions in the trees. And that should give a cleaner image overall. So I'll just take the shot now. And I'll show you the results on the screen. So now that I've got that wide angle shot in the bag, um, I'm happy with that. I'm going to just have a little experiment with the telephoto. I've got the um, 80 to 200 Nikon lens on. So what I'm doing is I'm focusing in on the chimney stacks and the slate um, chimneys below. Um, and I'm using the green contrast behind of the trees. Um, and I'm doing it on f2.8 because I want to blow out the trees and just have them as like a bit of a green haze and focus more on the actual slate. So I'll just take that shot now. And once I've played around with it in Lightroom, I'll show you the result. around a little bit to the left and um, this is giving me really good separation on the chimney stacks and um, I've got Snowden in the background crib gock I've got really good separation I've kept it at f2.8 um, and in doing so the backgrounds all blown out and um, blurred and I've got some foliage in the front here um, I'm focusing past the foliage so the foliage is all blurred out as well but it just adds a little bit of artistic influence into it
such a beautiful day here. It's hot. Really difficult to get around, especially with these different levels. And I am heading right up to the top of that one in a minute. But I'll just show you. That's the views for the minute. I'll just put a picture up of this from a few years ago. basically shooting the drum house and using it as a split so I'm shooting I'm overexposing for the shadows in the drums and I'm underexposing for the highlights through the through the drum house that you can see in the background so I'm doing a three a three stop shot overexposed by two stops on zero and underexposed by two stops hello I don't know why I was doing that um, and that's giving me the shot. So that's uh, all I've got time for uh, the, the Norwich Quarry. Um, I was going to go up another level, but I've run out of water, I've run out of energy, I've got a sore, sore knee, twisted my ankle. Um, you name it, I've got it. So I'm going to start making my way down now. It's probably about 40 minute walk back to the car. So um, I hope you like the video. I hope you like the footage and the pictures throughout. If you did like the video, please give it a like. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do. And leave me some comments down below um, with any ways you want me to improve it or just say hello. Okay, I'll see you in the next week's video. And thanks for watching.